very humble beginnings of that hole in the wall uh, where my father's standing in front with his arms crossed. And in no way were they thinking about anything back then that we have become today. I started out working in a, in a hot shop restaurant in Salt Lake City in the kitchen, and I loved the pace. I loved the fact that things got busy and you were scrambling and you were working and you were taking care of the customers, and I thought that was the most fun in the world. Oh, he looked very handsome in his Navy uniform. <laughs> So we didn't have a long courtship, but it just uh, worked. Well, the beginning of the business, nobody knew anything about the hotel business. When we opened our first hotel at the 14th Street Bridge in Washington, which we called Twin Bridges, I went to my dad one day and I said, why don't you let me try and run this hotel? He said, well, you don't know anything about the hotel business. I said, I know, but neither does anybody else around here. I think putting people first means listen to their concerns, giving people an audience, giving them an opportunity. Well, every time we open a hotel in the community, we hire people that are not trained. We say we hire friendly and trained technical. You know, you can start as a uh, bellman or, you know, washing dishes and grow to managing a hotel. I mean, the, the company really takes pride in that. When you look at the fact that 50% uh, of our general managers came out of the early ranks and the average general manager has been around for 25 years, that says something about the enduring culture of the core value of the company.